garbage do we make? Good morning. It is 525. Just getting ready to leave for the yard. Uh, so today I actually have a doctor's appointment early this morning. I'm going to let the guys go start pouring without me. I'm going to give Daryl the cameras, uh, the time lapse, and then I'm going to let him wear the head cam off this morning for a little while before I get there. So that should be interesting. We'll see how that goes. Uh, I did want to thank uh, many of you who have submitted emails uh, regarding the Easy Money Tour. Uh, I have a big pile of emails to go through, and I have some good ones in there, but it is going to take some time for me to get through the email, so uh, don't expect a response right away. If you don't get a response, don't get disappointed that I didn't pick you. I haven't picked anybody yet. So I'm going to get through those. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go back a video and watch it, and then uh, let me know and email me if you think you'd be a good candidate for the Easy Money Tour. So, All right, well, I'm going to get to the yard, see the guys off. Before I go to the doctor, I will see you guys at the coffee shop. Morning, Jewel. How are you? These machines are so loud. We should are. unplug them. Yeah, they are really. Just unplug them. Yeah. Hi. Yes. <laughs> now, do we got house plan this morning? We do. Are you sure? I'm sure. All right, let's go check. All right. Let's go check. Yeah. Wow, uh, did I just Oh, awesome. <laughs> Good job. Yeah. Dr. Bolt, good morning. Eric. Morning, Eric. How are you doing? What? You ready? Yeah, kind of. Great. So, uh, Ryan got to go. He has a doctor's appointment. So, me and my dad are going to do all the filming yeah? this yeah. morning. Put that on your head. You woke up early, huh? Yeah. All right. Eric woke up early. Oh, where's the video? Oh. You know why he woke up early? Daddy. I'll show you. Because of this. Eric, you better be awake. We're all about to come to your house. <laughs> <laughs> I sat to that this morning. Nice. Right. Good morning. You got Daryl Jr. here. And you got Daryl Jr. here too. So basically the game plan is to, to really pour the small patio with the diary extension and the sidewalk. So it's going to be a good pour. I like that help so. Gordon. Yeah, I'm good. You know what you're doing? Yeah. Alright. That's what I like to hear. Just go. You ready? Yes, sir. Are you ready? <laughs> Ryan! Ryan who? We don't know a Ryan. <laughs> Eric, uh, you ready? Yeah. All right. Are you ready? Are you ready? Oh, of course there, I'm man. ready. Eric, oh. you see that way you get pulled up, man. Yeah. Man, you got half a truck yet. We're not done pouring. Did you, how long ago did you finish pouring? Just like two minutes ago. 
Get the power button. Dude. That's not what we're going to stop. Oh, that was fine. He said I gotta lose some weight. I said, tell me something I don't know. Uh, so that was actually my fault. It's just some miscommunication. Uh, I told the guys to pour the sidecar parking and in my mind, that meant, you know, all the way down here. But honestly, it was no big deal at all. It's cool out, we're all in the shade, so. All right, Daryl, take this and wash it up, buddy. All right. How you been doing? Doing great. You gonna come with me once on the Easy Money Tour? Ooh, about to see what comes up and up. Wow, you're really picky, huh? Yeah. Sure, it's flat. Like really flat. I'm gonna put a battery in this and then I'm gonna start grading with Daryl. Yeah, sounds good. Grandpa, come along. Let's let's get this graded. Let's get this graded. If you ever cut a joint in on accident and you got to refill it in, always put concrete in there because you got to get rocks back in to the joint that you just made or it's going to crack anyway. You can't just fill over the joint with cream or it'll crack. You guys just going to be chilling back here till the concrete's hard? <laughs> Come on. Did you bring me, did Kathy make me a sandwich? She made tacos, and sliders. I swear I'm giving her a raise. I'm serious. <laughs> She's going to start getting a salary. <laughs> well she would have we would get more production on the job site and i would still get my sandwiches yep. that's a good idea <laughs> daryl you're careful you're on thin ice daryl i got bad news man yep. i got bad news what? uh i really need to use that skid loader oh that's not bad news oh okay just checking just go right ahead. all right thank you you're welcome See, I gotta kick your dad out and I gotta kick you off. <laughs> it's almost the same thing. Why does that look so you. heavy? So I got a this is all taco stuff. stuff. Oh, oh, man. Man. Yeah. And then she made open the other one. sour cream and everything. Man. Oh, they're gonna like these. I forgot what these are called. I don't know. I had one of those. I almost ate oh, them. Oh, it's right on the tip of my tongue. I can't Jimmy remember what they're called. No, hmm? they're not chimichanga. What are they called? What are these things called? Tamales. Tamales, thank you. you. Look at how, did, how are you smarter than everybody here? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Okay. Hey, is he the bathroom to use or not? Yeah, it's in the front door. Uh, basically, right when you go in, it's to the left. Turn the fan on. Yeah. Are you going? Are you going to the bathroom? Bathroom? Yeah. Are you really? Okay, Let me go first, man. Come on. I don't. I just have to go to the bathroom. I don't have to okay. go to the bathroom. Bathroom. If you know what I'm yeah. saying? And I ain't going there after you. Daryl, I got monetized on TikTok now. Hmm? I got monetized on TikTok. Really? No yes. Way. I'm making big money on TikTok. Oh, right. Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. I made 45 cents in the last week. Wow. Yes. Awesome. So when do you start going live on TikTok? Because then people can send you gifts, and that's how you make money. They're going to send me gifts? 
Yeah, people will send you gifts when you live on TikTok. <laughs> oh, I doubt that. I got like almost, I almost have like ten dollars so far. You got ten dollars already? Almost ten dollars. Man, gifts. you're loaded, man. Yeah. All right, me and Daryl are grading the driveway. Uh, the other three guys are uh, waiting for the concrete to set up in the back so they can start finishing. What'd you say? The back air tag. The back airbag? Airbag has a hole in it on the tag axle. Do we got duct tape? Yeah. Bob, did you poke a hole in the airbag so you don't have to work anymore? Yeah. Tell me the truth. All I know is I had the brakes on and I had to come to a quick stop. One axle was just going like this. I go. It's the back axle. axle. Are you making a TikTok? I have to. Oh that's man. That's I knew you were making a TikTok. <laughs> You broke it, man. Uh, what are you doing? You forgot something. I know. How's it look? Oh, I like it. You gotta say easy money on your last broom stroke, man. Yeah, I will, brother. <laughs> you say it every breath. You gotta say it here. I'm gonna make a TikTok. Wait. Just give me a second. I gotta get on there. That's cool. All right, hit it. Easy money. It's about time you showed up. Where you been? You've been gone for like two hours. Two and a half hours. At least you're honest this time. I'll take a Coke. My doctor just told me I gotta start a diet, but you yeah, can always right. start tomorrow, you know? Yeah, you can always start tomorrow. Yeah, actually, no, not not this week. Next week. Next week, yeah, not you, this week. Not. Let's, uh, let's get that approach graded. Actually, I gotta order concrete for the sidewalk, but we gotta grade that. No, nah, not today. Yeah. Tomorrow. Oh, why did you tell him? Oh, dude, oh, here we go. Ah. Come on. He told you we're pouring the whole thing at once? Yeah. No, Daryl did. Oh. <laughs> I told Eric that we were pouring the giant this. And then Bob said he doesn't even know how to find his way to work. <laughs> well, well, <thank> you, <laughs> You're an idiot, Bob. <laughs> no, I'm honest. I'm honest, idiot. You're a little fly. See, some people, when they get stressed out, they drink beer, they smoke drugs, whatever. When I get stressed out, I eat food. Eric, can you please get out of the way? We are literally, this approach is going to take us a week to grade at this rate. Come on, man. Hey, did you just let Daryl help you with the electric? Yeah. Uh, oh, good Good luck, man. I suggested it. Good luck. Bugs. Yeah. Don't you, got, you got a utility knife? No. Because you may need it to cut that back open. I'm just saying. Bob calls, he just got back. He just got this terrible. Yeah, right. He did. He said there was a traffic jam. No, it's been like two hours or no, it's oh, been like three hours. Yeah, he just, I, just me up. Yeah, I he, hope you're kidding. He got 15 hours this week already. He always gets 15 hours. It's like magic. Even when he doesn't work the whole week, he always says, I had 15 hours. Well, that's because it's that's, amazing. That's because don't forget, he put air in the tire tab and he checked Oh, yeah, that's right. That's why it was off the rim on Monday morning. Yeah. Yep, I remember. All right, it is uh, 11.40 concretes in 20 minutes for the front sidewalk. We got the rest of the driveway set up and graded. Uh, these guys down here are just sweeping up, cleaning up the road. And a uh, sidewalk should be here soon. Why do you need the wire truck? No. Let me go. I'm gonna move this truck. No. Who, me? No, I'm moving this. 
Well, go ahead. We don't want to. Why do we want to move the wire truck in the way? Don't we want to put wire mesh in there now? In where? In it's already in the sidewalk. In the driveway. We're not doing the side the driveway right now. I think we could. This isn't even compacted yet. I know. It's first things first, man. Come on. I know we, got to... we do the same thing every day, and sometimes you still don't understand the process. Yeah, I do. After I 20, over 20 years in concrete work. I want to get the wire mesh in. No, it's not even compacted yet. I'm compact. You, yeah, good luck getting past him. I'm compacting bugs. Uh, what do you want to do? Well, I don't know. It's going on. It's still with my compactor. Yep, hey. told you, man. We can just, oh, it is. Look at, <laughs> my name is on it. Do you want, so I did want to explain what these are, because some of you have probably never seen these before. These are actually called, all these little red dowels you see, these are called speed dowels. And what they are, is there a way uh, to create a hole in the concrete so you can dowel one pour to the next without having to drill it in afterwards. So once the concrete's poured, this red part actually stays in the concrete and that's your hole the uh, steel slides right into. And then this gray part comes back out with the form. Um, so we put these on here because we double form this and if we were just to pour it, it would be very hard to get a hammer drill in between this little eight inch gap to be able to drill into the edge of the concrete. So that's what these are all for. We dial it all in so that border never separates from the main sidewalk or the center of the sidewalk. Move that bucket right now. He can, right there, he can come up with the buggy right here. Hold up, hold up. Okay, let's, let's do what I just told everybody to do. You're gonna back up and fill the buggy right here so concrete doesn't splatter all over the front of my newly painted truck. I want you to think about this. If you filled the buggy up right here, what do you think would happen? Bad. Uh, Something bad would happen. What do you think it would be? Uh, concrete. Concrete would splatter where? Uh, uh, all over the truck, that's right. We got a really skinny walkway, so only fill them up like a little bit less than half. Right. Even a little less than half. You ready? Yes, sir. You look ready. I'm born ready. You were born ready? Yeah. Wow. Born. Eric, what would you like to say to all your fans today? Uh, get it done. That's it? Yeah. Oh, you're boring, man. I know you're You're boring. Okay. You're not going to have any fans if that's all you got. I think we should do a broad try locally here for all our fans who are going to come to a broad try. You would act like we're famous. We would probably have like <laughs> we would probably have like three people show up. Yeah, right. And it would be Kathy and my wife and my mom. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, 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 right. <laughs> All our fans, give me a break, man. <laughs> we got to get every bit of that out of there. Are you guys fighting again? Nothing. Can you scrape these two forms, please? Yes, sir. I gotta, we gotta set them again. <laughs> you guys need to stop fighting. You need to stop fighting. We're not. Yeah, right. We're not. And this is true. He did it something like right. Do the things that I'm not supposed to do. We're just not around already. Yeah, man, you're really not a rapper. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah, you're really not a rapper. Okay, let's hear you rapping. Oh, he'll tear you apart. Yeah, all right. You be looking over here like Eminem. You want me to spit 16 bars victory style? Oh, yeah. Tell me the truth. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, I don't even know what a bar is, man. I saw that. On, I saw that on YouTube. How's your TikTok doing that you made this morning? How many views did you get? I haven't even checked. You better check. It could be blowing up. Why is it taking so long? You got dial up or what? <laughs> you guys got to lift it over the string too. Suck it in with the yeah, screw. Big screw Why are you trying to hammer screws in, Eric? Man, I got to teach you greenhorns everything. He's trying to hammer screws in. Wow. Nope, that's not gonna be. That's not gonna work, man. That's got to be straight. Go fix that, Daryl. Would you? It's taking forever, man. You got a few minutes now, right? We should go eat. Hey, we're gonna go eat on the patio. All right. You guys need a break, man. Cause you guys just aren't thinking right now. He sucked all the screws in all the way. So I, like, I might as well just cut it right out. Oh, Eric. Eric, just leave that alone, man. You're gonna do more damage than good. Look at what bugs got us. Isn't that nice? 
Yes. That's because Bugs is a millionaire. Everybody thinks that. He's got six or seven vehicles. All my hard work was rewarded by a complete stranger. Mm -hmm. Pretty awesome. I'm just so confused, man. I don't know how you got so big and you're so picky you don't eat anything. I, I, I never see him eat nothing. That's all he eats at home is chicken. KFC? Popeyes? I mean, I know why I'm chicken getting big. Chicken? I eat a lot of food. I never I see him eat. Daryl looks good in that bird nest. I do. He's seven yeah. pounds. You see that? He's yeah. moving like a little baby. Yep. This is the one right here. You go like this. <laughs> oh, you saw that already? Yep. When did you watch that? I just put it at 7 this morning. You guys were watching videos while you were supposed yeah, to be video. working? <laughs> hey, we wanted to give a shout out to Alan from Georgia. Everybody's here. We're on the back patio. Hey, we're having hey. pizza. Thank and, you, uh, Alan. Yes. I appreciate it, brother. You're a good man. Yep, so Bugs uh, bought us pizza with part of the money that you sent. We really oh. appreciate that, man. That was an awesome gesture that nobody, no, none of us will forget. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. <coughs> Are you okay? <laughs> what are you doing, man? Another guy called me. He's a multimillionaire. Did I tell you that? I told somebody that here today. No. He's got a 10,000 square foot hot rod shop, like custom hot rods with the rotisseries and, a, you know, they weld everything custom and everything. Oh, he wow. called me, invited me down. Yeah, I, I, I talked to him for like a half an hour last night. Oh, wow. Yeah. He was like, you got to want it. You got to taste it. <laughs> 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 That's what he was saying. He was talking about being successful. It's like, man, I don't really care about all that. I'm just going to do my thing and whatever happens, mm -hmm. happens. I ain't trying to taste success. I just do my thing and if success comes, it comes. Uh -huh. All I know how to do is work hard. You know what I'm saying? I bet you a dollar I finish my side before they finish there. Start it out. <laughs> really not do it. Three to one. There's nothing to it. Because <laughs> there's a border here too. Oh. That's 16 inches wide. It's like a little curve. Yeah. Caught that and then give me that other piece. It's good right where it is. It's good? Yeah, right now, right where it is right now. Huh? The pink string is good. Okay. Yeah. Daryl, come here. Sweep this road. Sweep this all in here. And then we gotta rinse that creamy water out of there. Okay? Third. Now we're up and running. What am I doing? Yeah. I am actually putting caution tape up right now. Ah, cool. What are you doing? Uh, I am walking around, taping well, everything, nice see okay. what everybody's Name doing. five things you got accomplished today. I set forms, strip forms. You set forms? Yeah. You watch the set forms. Try no. again. Number one. I, I set forms. Okay. You stood no, and watched, no, no, no. dude. Okay. Come on, be honest. You stood and watched a set form. Okay. That doesn't count. Next. The trick is, uh, I went anything? to the bathroom, got you a soda. You did go to the bathroom and get me a soda. I really don't know if I can really count that though. I brought lunch, but you didn't have any because Bugs bought pizza. So that doesn't count okay. either. So you did two things. Uh, you went, wait, wait, you went wait. to the bathroom and got me a soda. Wait, uh, Man, you're going to get a raise for today. Cool. Thanks. He's still on the gravy. <laughs> no, we just, we can't leave, we can't leave stuff hanging like this because it's going to fall out of that garbage can. And this goes through somebody's windshield on the freeway. It's not going to be a good sight. Eric, are you tired? Not at all? Yeah, kind of. We didn't really do much today, to no, be honest. No, no, we no. really didn't. We didn't pour much concrete, and there wasn't that much to set. Why don't you shave your face yeah. for tomorrow? 100,000 subscribers, yep. face reveal. Daryl Jr. Yeah. Oh, okay, man. Cut. We're going to shave you today. Not yep. all the way, I'm, just trim no, it, man. Yeah, you my... gotta shave it all the way out, but trim it up, man. Yeah, you need a haircut and a beard trim. You look I'll do that today. Today. Yeah, it's fine. Honestly, you look like Sasquatch. Yeah. 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 You look like you're you fresh do. out of the like hair. You look like Now, Bugs is a mustache. <laughs> hey, that's you know, not a mustache. You know, he needs dirt. dirt. <laughs> you need to put the. <laughs> that's dirt. Well, what do you call Eric, though? So? Look at look at Eric. That's far. Eric, what is that? He's been growing. Hey, he's been what, growing that since he was doing? twelve. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys in the morning. All right. Well, it's a truck you drive. You got to take care of it like it's your own. Yep, exactly. That's why you check the stuff, man. You just assume somebody else did it, but they don't. Now you got to put that strap on. Throw it over. I'll hold it on. 
All right, it's a little after two o'clock. We're done for the day on this job, which is good because I have stuff to do this afternoon. So you guys saw us pour and finish the patio. That was the first thing we did this morning. We cut it up into really, really small pieces. It looks very, very nice. And I finished it, broomed it. And then uh, we poured the sidecar parking this morning, which you saw. And then when I arrived this morning, as I mentioned, there was just some miscommunication. Bugs, I, t I told Bugs, pour the sidecar parking. And uh, in my mind, it meant all of this. And in Bugs' mind, it meant up to the corner. So that was on me. I should have communicated better what I was looking for, but that really was no big deal. When I got here, we just, you know, we set the shut off and poured. It was fast and easy. Uh, driveway's all set up. It's ready to pour. So the ribbons are set. We're actually gonna pour the ribbons last on this job, but tomorrow we're gonna pour this driveway. And then you guys saw we poured this front sidewalk, just a little bitty thing. It was like two yards, but we cut it up into real small sections. But now you can get a better idea what these colored and stamped ribbons are gonna look like. It's gonna look real sharp. It's gonna be like a light gray color with some dark gray mixed in kind of to match the house. And then these borders flow right down into the driveway. So should be real nice. All right, so the weather is supposed to be good tomorrow morning. So I will see you guys right back here for this concrete pour. Adios.